demonstrate uh, no effect. Same for the big cells. Um, the huge game changer is this, if you sink a little bit further, that actually, like that, we could skip the BMS in case it would fail and just put two hard switches on it and get emergency power to get home because you cannot overcharge, you cannot over decharge, you cannot put it on fire with anything of those measures. So this is for us a real game changer in safety game. Uh, they are in fact less pricey than our current NMC uh, batteries. So even in price it's better. Of course there is one minus point, it is they are 30% more heavy than our current high energy NMC cells that we have here. Uh, but with uh, 7.3 kilos per kilowatt we are still very well within the competitive field. Plus if we talk eco, we can easily reach 10,000 cycles with those cells. That is for ferries, again a big game changer. We uh, are very efficiently using the materials because we can use them for two to three times as long as the NMC technology batteries or 30% longer than existing LFP batteries today. This of course is an early stage, so we expect this energy density to go up. Uh, this will take a couple of years to go up slowly in percentage, but uh, it's great that we are able to present this today. And I'm pretty sure you will learn more about this very soon, very fast. So Ben, you're gonna be my witness here. Okay. Do you need glasses or you see, <laughs> you can still see that? So I, I can see it. You can see that. So here we have, what do you read? 3.413 volts. Yeah, so that is a full cell uh, in uh, this technology. It's actually even a little bit overcharged uh, by maybe three, four percent. So I'm taking a metal screwdriver. What is the capacity of that cell? That cell is 37 amp hours. We're only using one cell. The real cell that we have in the in the finished EPT battery has 280 amps. So this is a metal screwdriver. Can you confirm yes, that? Yes, it is. Yeah, it has been used before. Some somewhat dull. Yeah, makes it harder. Uh, that's the best hammer we could find in Metz. So we're what? gonna try this. Maybe you want to step up a little bit what now. What would be the impact of, well? of a dead short on that? Sorry? What would be the impact of a dead short on the terminals? Would it battery swell? Uh, it will uh, warm up. It will swell a little bit, but nothing else than that. <laughs> but this is not what we're going to demonstrate it's today for, because yeah. I got approval from Metz to do what I'm doing now. So I'm, <laughs> you know, I don't want to go out of boundaries here. And as always, we put the safety. <laughs> so just have to be sure we get into a hole. This actually is very good wine and we need to drink it because it's already 10 years old. I found it yesterday in the cellar. Okay. So, this is definitely punctured, as you can see. Can you touch this for me? Yeah. Is it getting warm? I do not feel it, if it is. Okay. Shall we test the voltage? Three eight, so it did go out uh, down a little bit. The trick here is that these solid state cells they do not have electrolyte that is liquid, and it's the liquid electrolyte that catches fire normally. So, with this cell, still not hot, no fire, no smoke. Of no course, discharge. yeah, there was a slight discharge, of course. I am putting a shortage inside the cell with this between the plus and the minus. So it is now slowly discharging. I will make a demonstration that there is still power in here. You can see the sparks. Definitely there is still a lot of power in here. Because it was so much fun, we're gonna do it again. 
I meant no discharge, nothing came out of the battery. Yeah, no, no smoke. No fluid. I mean, I'm really bad to this here now. <laughs> Let's see again if we have heat. No, nothing. Now, ladies and gentlemen, I have been exploding the last couple of years a lot of batteries, a lot of them. This is the most exciting thing I have facing because nothing happens. And that is the big change, really. So that's it for my demonstration. Thank you. You will hear more. Let's one more voltage check. You're still hanging in there, 3.36. Yeah. The battery <laughs> will be discharged by tomorrow because we did put structural damage and it will now slowly over time, of course, uh, discharge. Without. But you're not supposed to shoot batteries and think you can still use them afterwards. Yeah.